How's it going, brother? What you up to today? Working. On what? I'm um, here just making sure everybody's good and safe. You're just standing here? Yes, sir. Do you think that's a valuable waste or allotment of our tax resources to have you just standing here? Sir, if you want to, you can talk to DCPI if you have any concerns or anything like that. That's fair, but it also is important to realize when we have untested rape kits and cold cases, sometimes just somebody standing on the corner may not be the most effective use of our taxpayer funds is what I'm trying to say. Does that make sense? You can talk to DCPI. I will, I will. And uh, what's the Third Amendment? Do you know it? Do you know the Sir, First this Amendment? Time, if, if you don't have any concerns or anything else, well, I do with, have a concern with because any crimes that are being committed. Well, you I do. Talk to DCPI, I do have. A, they can answer everything. Else. I do have a concern because you took a sacred oath to uphold our constitutional rights, and I'm not sure if you know them. Yeah. Do you know the Third Amendment, sir? I do, sir. What is it? But I'm not here to, to discuss about Third Amendment. <laughs> no, nah, th no, that's your, literally your job. Them. That's literally your job. Your job is to uphold our Bill of Rights. So you should yeah. be here to answer all questions about the Bill of Rights. You should be an expert in that. You know. Lawyers go to school for seven years. You should at least brush up on it. What's the Third Amendment? Look, I'll let, you, I'll let you off with the warning if you just let me know what the Third Amendment is. Have a great day, sir. So you don't know the Third Amendment? Have a great day. You could just humbly admit that you don't know it. Have a great day, sir. I cannot have a great day. I was having a beautiful Sunday afternoon and I realized the overall incompetence and lack of knowledge. You know, when men, women, and children have given blood, sweat, and tears for this country and the Bill of Rights, and you don't even know it, that's sad. What's your name and badge number? Yo, All right, listen, Australia. I'm going to let you off today with a warning. Next time I come around here, I want you to know that Third Amendment. All right? Good, also, check up on the Federalist Papers and the Anti-Federalist Papers for context. What's the Third Amendment? That's what he wants to do. So he can get his YouTube, his YouTube video. Well, actually, sir, my channel's not monetized. It doesn't matter. Well, do you, do you want to know the real reason I'm doing this? That's a, fi that's a fair assault, assumption. But as you know, as an investigator, there are other potential theories. One of them would be that men, women, and children have given blood, sweat, and tears to give us freedom to have that Bill of Rights. And the fact that I've went across this country the last few months and not, and not one cop, not, and that's all they do? Yeah, you don't know your own job. You don't know your own job. I'm upset because people died to give us our freedoms and you don't even know the oath you took. You didn't even read. Did you read the oath you took? No, you didn't. Because you just swear to anything. Whatever the man tells you to do, yes sir, sign me up. I'd rather be a YouTuber than working for the system. I am doing my YouTube thing. What's the Third Amendment? I'll let you off with a warning if you can tell me the Third Amendment. This is serious shit. No, honestly, you guys are laughing. People died. People died. Oh, it's only funny when you guys do it. Okay, I get it. I see, I see. So what's the Third Amendment? And I'll let you be on your way, sir. What's the Third Amendment? You think I have to interact with what's you what's the Third Amendment? Are you, do you have me stop? Until until you ask answer my questions, what's the Third Amendment? You think, bro? You don't know it, do you? That's sad. You're laughing at me, and you don't even know your own job, the basics of your own job. It's not even a big pamphlet. It's this little tiny book. You should read it. What made you want to become a cop? Was it qualified immunity? Can I have your name and badge number, sir? Sure. Last name's Lyle Palmer, badge number is 2117. Your name and badge number? 12741. I'm going to let you off with a warning because I'm in a good mood today. But you seriously should learn the Constitution. Don't, I mean, don't you think it's astounding that I've asked literally dozens, if not hundreds of cops, and they don't know their own job? I think it's funny that you guys don't know your own job. I think it's sad and I think it's pathetic. It's not, it's not something to be thanked. You guys just stand around here all day. There's how many cold cases in New York City? How many untested rape kits? Would you guys just stand over here making sure someone doesn't steal three for $10 t-shirts? That's a terrible waste of our tax money. Talk to the mayor. Talk to the mayor. No, see, that's the thing. Oh, well, guess what? See, and this is, I'm going to teach you. It doesn't matter what you say. Look, lap. No, I'm, I'm, I'm actually giving, uh, I, I can be funny, but I'm also giving some real education too, yeah. I'm giving you guys a free education. As my servant, I'm giving you guys a free education. Listen, yes, you can go to the mayor, right? That's true. 
But when you swear, this is why I'm stopping you guys today, is because when you swear an oath to the Constitution, you don't just follow illegal orders. After World War II, Nuremberg, what happened? Just following orders didn't cut it. So the mayor can give you any illegal orders it wants, but you swore an oath to protect our right against illegal orders. So I suggest you gentlemen start learning that. Thanks for your suggestion. You're welcome. Next time I might not be so easy on you boys, so learn up. How's it going, dude? What's up? Good. What do you think the Knicks' chances are this year? Hope it's good. Yeah? Hope it's good, man. What's the Third Amendment? You tell me. Well, you took an oath to it, so you should know it, right? <clears throat> I'm asking you to tell me. Do you know it? I mean, you can tell me. I'll tell you if it's right or not. All right. I'm going to quiz you if it's right or not. All right. It is cruel and unusual punishment. What's that? That's an amendment, but it's not the third. Okay, okay, you're good, okay. <clears throat> what's your, what's the first amendment? I'll give you an easy one. Freedom of speech, man. There's other parts though, right? Freedom of speech, right to protest. Okay, 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 okay. Right to... Do I sound like Denzel there? Okay, okay. I'm trying, I'm trying. Uh, well, brush up, man. I appreciate you. You look intimidating enough. I wouldn't want to steal anything around you. Can I have your name and badge number, sir? Right. Amberston, one 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 four seven. Thank you. Be safe. All Please right. brush Be up safe. on the Constitution. Be safe.